Hi, this is Dr. Don. I want to take a few minutes and show you how to create a new project in RStudio Desktop. Pretty simple. I'm just going to go up here to File, New Project, and then I want to put it into an existing directory where I have some data files. So I'm going to click Existing Directory, then I need to browse and find the directory, and it's on my desktop and it is business data lit and I'm going to put it inside the desktop and click open and then create project and it is thinking and it's creating that project and putting some additional files into that directory that we'll need for later on. It takes a few seconds sometimes for it to process. Okay, so there is our new project and you can see it's listed down there with the name Lab Desktop Project. It's the lab templates we're going to use and the data files we're going to use. And you can see the path to it up here. See Users, Don, my name, Desktop, business data lip and then inside the lab desktop folders pretty easy and it's a neat thing to know how to do and you'll use it off one of the really good things about creating an R studio desktop project is it makes it easy easier to get back to where you were after you shut down R I'm going to go ahead and just close out here file I'm just going to quit the whole session close the project first and then quit the session so R is gone and when you want to go back just navigate to where you stored that R project file here it is and I'll just double click on it and there we go a little bit slow to catch up here And it's slowly coming around. It's got to open up again. But you can see it took me back right where I wanted to be into that directory where that project is and where our lab templates are going to be for all the labs. So that's a neat thing about our Studio Desktop. Our Studio Cloud is a little bit different. You don't create a project like this that's saved on your local computer, but we'll show you that in the walkthrough video that's next.